hello everyone and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here welcome in general today's video it's very exciting because i haven't done one of these in a really long time today's video is gonna be a haul i had to go to the store to buy literally everything i ran out of everything you know how it is like you run out of toothpaste the next day you run out of body wash and then the next day you run out of lotion and then the next day you run out of mouthwash and like it's all like one after another and then you're like i need to buy everything i went to ulta i went to target and i went to tj maxx and I'm gonna share everything that I got. So if you want to know what I got, then just keep on watching. We're gonna go out of order. <laughs> so I'm gonna start with Ulta. I feel like a lot of you are gonna be interested in what I got at Ulta. So the first thing I got at Ulta was the Arctic Fox Bleach Please Bleach Kit. It comes with the cream bleach a developer and a pair of gloves and i buy this one because it's cruelty free and it works very well um it's a little liquidy to my liking but i feel like it lightens up the hair very well and the reason i got this was because i need help okay i don't even know what is going on here anymore and i need to fix it so we're gonna try to fix it today after i film this video i like that 15 percent of profits donated to prevent animal cruelty i love that you know and i love arctic fox and i love all their products so i figured this would be very very good i've actually used this before actually but i used the whole thing by accident i was like i don't know it doesn't look like enough and then i used the whole thing i think today i'm only gonna use half because i can save half for now half for when i need to touch up and it's just to fix this part i don't know my hair grows really fast i don't remember the last time i got it done it's maintenance it's maintenance day for me continuing with the hair products the next product i got was the ordinary natural moisturizing factors plus ha and it's a lightweight hydrating serum for the scalp and it supports the natural maintenance of scalp hydration to promote scalp health relieve discomfort and target dryness shake well before use massage a few drops thoroughly into clean dry scalp once daily ideally at bedtime this formula is a leave-in treatment do not wash hair or scalp after application i saw this on the ulta website and i was interested because i have the driest scalp ever the ordinary has very good skincare products i'm just interested in trying it out hopefully it works for me this was pretty inexpensive it was 12 dollars 80 that's pretty expensive the bleach kit was 16 dollars 72 i had a 10 dollars off 40 so that's how it was a little discounted usually it's like 20 bucks save myself quite a bit of money the next product i purchased was the elf stay all night microfine setting mist i've never tried this before i am wearing it today so hopefully we'll see how my makeup lasts i love the fine mist and i love how it has like a metal ball in there to like help you shake up the product i feel like that's really nice usually you don't see that with setting sprays that was eight dollars and 36 cents the next product i purchased is the nyx this is milky gloss in ube ube milkshake ube 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 <laughs> i don't know how to pronounce it but i purchased this i don't know if i like that smell <laughs> but it seems like a very nice color i'm gonna throw it on this retailed for eight dollars and fifty cents but i got it for 7-eleven with my coupon 7-eleven and i don't know let's Put on a little it's a uh, very pigmented my lips were very dry so like i kind of needed a lip a lip gloss it's very pretty i think it added to the lip combo um formula is very nice actually not sticky at all i know i'm not a fan of the scent i'm sorry if you can hear like chainsaws it's because they're literally chainsawing like giant wooden trunks because they cut a tree down poor tree but you know it is what it is the next product i picked up was a ColourPop super shock shadow in the shade dream much this retailed originally for six dollars but with my coupon i got it for five dollars and two cents and if i can get into it it'd be great this was part of their all amethyst collection and i have the all amethyst palette and i actually have a review on that palette i've been looking for like sparkly purple sparkly purple shades because I've been missing that sparkly purpleness and I swatched it at the store and it was very very nice very very pretty there it is it's very very 
kind of sheer but I feel like over top that purple palette it would look so much better it just has such a nice little purple sparkle to it the next product was a repurchase this is from nyx it's the lift and snatch brow tint pen in espresso this retails for 12 dollars, but i got it for ten dollars and three cents i already have this but mine's is i can tell it's running out you can tell they're running out when the liquid starts to just gore out everywhere and then you're like what the hell mine's was getting really disgusting and very very messy so i feel like i needed a re-up on this product so that's what i did and it worked it worked wonders for my brows today usually I have to work hard but not today and then the last product i got at Ulta was the LA Girl Shockwave Lip Liner in Maple Glaze. I picked this up because it looked very, very, very similar. It looked very similar to my KKW liner. And you know, KKW is like gone at the moment. <laughs> yeah, I think it's a spot on dupe for it. So we're gonna see right now. Oh, very creamy. Very, very creamy. This is in the shade Maple Glaze. And I have the KKW in the shade Nude 1. I think it's a dupe. It looks very, very similar. So I have the KKW over here. And then I have Maple Glaze from LA Girl over here. Very similar colors. In my opinion, it is a dupe. So, Miss KKW, I miss you. Please come back. <laughs> you brought a skincare, but I don't want skincare. I'm missing your fragrance line, and I'm missing your lipsticks and lip liners. Where are they? Why did you take them away? Were they not doing you well? I think they were. But now I have this one. This is spot on dupe. And it's going to be my new, my new KKW lip liner for now. Yeah, that's what I got at Ulta. I'm excited to dye my hair because it looks awful. I feel like next we have to do TJ Maxx. The first product I got at TJ Maxx was this Batman mirror from Makeup Revolution. Guys, I got this for, for 50 cents. Like, zoom in. Come on. 50 cents. It was marked down like a, f a fuck ton. 50 cents. And the mirror is very nice. It's very lightweight. It doesn't like way a lot and i use it to do my makeup today it's very freaking nice and i remember wanting the batman mirror when this whole batman collection came out because i wasn't really interested in any of the rest of the collection i just really wanted this batman mirror and 50 cents 50 cents you can't beat that the next thing i got was a pack of hair clips um i don't know how these are i don't know if my hair can even hold this clip i liked the colors of the clips you know and like they're like a soft matte i wanted them because i have this clip i've had this clip for a very long time and i just found it again recently and been using it and i love it i don't know why i ever stopped wearing my hair in a clip let's try it i usually just twist pull it up and then i just i just clip it i mean <laughs> It doesn't really hold all of it, but it'll it'll do the job until I can find one just as big as this one. This one just holds it just right. This one is a little smaller. It'll do the job. And I kind of want to wear my hair like this now. <laughs> These were, as I say, they were $7.99 for pack of three. The next product I purchased at TJ Maxx was this plush spa headband and it just has little bare ears uh i tend to not put my hair up when i do my skincare or anything so i figured this would be nice so i can relax while i put my skincare on because <laughs> usually i'm just like oh i'm done but i should enjoy putting my skincare on like you know so we're gonna try to do that more and it has very plush very soft and i love bears Bears are the cutest, okay? I know they're like the most dangerous animal, but like from afar, they're so cute. Like the ears, come on, come on. The next product. Now this was like literally found on a whim. <laughs> I didn't plan on buying this. I just picked it up from the shelf and I saw that it was on sale for $2 cause the packaging is a little dirty, but I'm not using the packaging. I'm using what's inside the packaging. It's purple hair dye. It's perfect for me. <laughs> it's cruelty free. It fades gradually and it's ultra conditioning and it's Care Bears. It's Care Bear themed and this one is the Share Bear. One day, Share Bear went to the salon. Afterwards, her fur looks fabulous, but it made her sad because she didn't know how to share her good feeling with anyone else. 
She did what anyone would do. Turn to Instagram for comfort. Sherbear took a cute little selfie of her new fur do and tagged INH Babe in the caption. Little did she know she was sharing. All the other bears got to see Sherbear feeling beautiful and that made them happy, which made Sherbear happy. <laughs> That's cute. And it's just like a very nice, like, purple like usually this is kind of the similar purple vibe i put in my hair so i figured two dollars i mean i don't know how much these go for regularly and it can't i can't really see i uh, see the original price for tj maxx was at 9.99 and then it says compare at 14 dollars so i kind of got a really good deal on this i'm excited to put it on i'm gonna do my hair with this after i, I bleach the part that needs to be bleached i'm gonna put the purple and then we're gonna be back back in business the next product i found at tj maxx was another another product that was marked down this is what i use to clean my my cooter i use this this is from the honey pot it's the sensitive foaming wash it has no parabens no dioxides and it's plant-based it's made by humans with vaginas for humans with vaginas because it takes one to no one. I was suffering with bacterial vaginosis for eight months when an ancestor came to me in a dream and gifted me with a vision to heal myself. With her help, I created the Honeypot Co. to solve for what other brands wouldn't through the power of herbs. And I know this is like TMI, but before I started using this, I was not in a good place down there. My pH was just all over the place and I couldn't figure out what the problem was. I still to this day don't know what the problem is. I went to the gyno, they didn't help me, so <laughs> I'm still back and forth. But what I know is, is that I will continue buying this because nothing else has worked as well as this has. So just a little TMI, but if you're having issues, I feel like that would help you. And I always get the sensitive version because I know there's like another version, but it's not sensitive. But this was $5.50. And usually I pay like $10 for this. I was like, I can't not buy it because I have one currently in my shower. But it's always nice to have a backup of things, especially when they're on clearance. Come on. The last product that I purchased at TJ Maxx was a four pack of hair turbans. Simply wrap your hair and button, and it's a four pack. And these are literally hair towels because my boyfriend likes to use them. I like to use them. <laughs> Seems pretty nice. You can just like wrap it up, dry it. They're very soft. They seem very high end. Usually I get microfiber towels, but um, the ones they had there didn't seem high quality at all. And I just wanted to know that my hair was in good in good hands. Of course someone grabbed it. I'm gonna wash them before I use them on my hair. But they were $10 for four and they felt like very good quality. So I did what any good person would do and I bought them for $9.99. And that's my what I got at TJ. And I never shop at TJ but I should. I got such good stuff at such a good price. Like what the heck. That mirror 50 cents? Come on, come on. And I found it underneath a ton of products. I had to like, I had everything in my hands and I was like trying to like, carefully lift things. And then I saw the price and I was like 50 cents. I was like done. And then I walked straight to the checkout line. And then I went to Target. Target, oh, Target. <laughs> Why? Because I needed literally everything. Let's start with pads, shall we? This is the Cora the peace of mind overnight pad 100 percent organic cotton recently there has been this thing going around tiktok saying that a lot of our pads and tampons have an ingredient called titanium dioxide and it's not very good for your cooter and apparently it causes reproductive issues so if you're out there and you're using always cortex like all those brands i would advise you to go and look for something better and that's what i've been doing we also have these these rail organic pads i purchased these and these are very nice also. I'm, I'm currently trying out the Coras right now because I am on my period. But I tried these out and I slept in them and they were pretty good. They're not as sticky as the Always ones that I would wear all the time. But recently I've been wanting to switch because Always is in cruelty free as much as I really love their pads stickiness and how they stay on. I would prefer to purchase something like this, something like this. 
where they're cruelty free and like I don't have to worry and you get protection for 10 hours so I already like the wrapper because it's so plastic these are different the wrapper and these are like soft and like mesh I feel like they're like biodegradable or something this is plastic so but like they're similar to the always ones so I like that and I feel like I'll use these for like daily wear the rail and I'll use the Koras for sleeping because I feel like there's more protection. But yeah, that's what I've been dealing with and like they were sold out. The normal large size was sold out everywhere so I had to like find what there was. I, I stopped at the dollar section and I got some pumpkins because they're very cute and falls around the corner. So I got me some pumpkins. I don't know where I'm going to put them but I got me some pumpkins. They're very cute and I love them. They were a dollar each. <laughs> the next product I got were Flamingo razors for $9.49. These are the razors I use to shave. And I have like three left. So I, I went and I got four more just in case. You never know. Sometimes they get rusty and you gotta change them. So I was like doing myself a favor. The next product that I purchased was the Native Detoxifying Charcoal Toothpaste with Fluoride because fluoride is an anti-cavity and I like to have fluoride because if not I feel like I get cavities all the time. This is my favorite toothpaste, you guys. <laughs> my teeth have gotten significantly wider using this toothpaste. Okay, and I don't know if it's the toothpaste or something else, maybe because I stopped drinking so much coffee, but I find that it works really, really well, and I was really low on my other toothpaste, so I went ahead and I purchased it. Even though I thought they were sold out, I couldn't find them. I was like, do they not have them? Because I'm scared, and I have to find it, because I need to brush my teeth. This was just something fun I found <laughs> in the beauty section. This is from Mega Babe, and I've never tried anything from Mega Babe before, but I am a thicker woman, okay? I got my thighs and my thighs touch, and I like to wear shorts because it is literally 100 degrees out here. So I got this Thigh Rescue Anti-Friction Stick with Aloe, Pomegranate, and Grapeseed Oil. Swipe on inner thighs or wherever you chafe for a smooth frictionless glide, free of aluminum, made with soothing aloe and vitamin E, reapply as needed, tested on mega babes, never on animals. So I love that. It has like an orangey citrusy scent. I put a little bit of this on as soon as I left the Target and I felt relief okay my thighs rub together like no one's business my thighs do that i just it comes with me i'm gonna keep trying this <laughs> and i will let you know how i feel in a future favorites fails video another thing i repurchased was my favorite deodorant at the moment and i tried to find a different smell like a different scent i was in between this one and the coconut vanilla and they had the no plastic packaging but i like to be able to like use the um i like to put it in my purse <laughs> so i feel like the the no plastic one would just get all ruined in my purse whereas this one i can just twist it down put the cover on it and it'll be fine so that's why i got that it looks like i bought two deodorants but i didn't the next two things i got were like re-ups because i'm out already and i purchased these like a month ago so if you didn't know Ashley Tesdale came out with her own body care line at Target and I've been wanting to get a different scent but I literally was in the Target like section that I needed to be to buy this stuff and it looked like a Ross or a Marshalls or a TJ Maxx like everything was everywhere and I couldn't find the product that I really needed to smell so I just got the one I had before. This one is... <laughs> Soothe and Comfort Cashmere Vanilla by Being Frenchy. And this is the Renewing Body Wash. I love this stuff. It smells so good. It's a pretty big bottle. It lasted me like a month. And I think this was $10. $10.99. I haven't been saying prices to anything. My deodorant was... How much was my deodorant? $12.99. And the Mega Babe Thigh Rescue was $13.99. And then I also purchased the Milky Body Lotion, which was $14.99. And the last two products in the haul, <laughs> I purchased the Thera Breath Dentist Formulated Fresh Breath Oral Rinse. And this is in this, this flavor. <laughs> Feels wrong to say that. In the flavor Invigorating Icy Mint. This is just 
this is what I use. This is my favorite uh, mouthwash ever. And I haven't had one in my boyfriend's house, which is where we like sleep. So like we brush our teeth there and we haven't had one of these. So now we have one. Okay, I'm just checking. I should have checked that it was sealed because people were animals at that Target that I went to today. It's not my normal Target. Usually my normal Target isn't that bad. The giant bottle of mouthwash was $14.99. <sighs> I felt like I was in there for an hour just getting this stuff because people don't know how to act in Target. They really don't know. The last product I purchased is another body lotion. I like to have different options, okay? So don't judge. I like to have moisture because I'm a dry bitch. So I need the moisture. <laughs> so this is from EOS Evolution of Smooth. And this is the Shea Butter 24 Hour Moisture Body Lotion in the scent Vanilla Cashmere. It has seven nourishing oils and butters and it has 24 hour moisture soothing protection for dry skin. And it's not tested on animals. It's gluten free, paraben and phthalate free. Dermatologist tested and hypoallergenic. And it smells like whipped vanilla, soft musk and cozy caramel. This smells fantastic. This is like heaven in a bottle. I'm... I have another one. This one's like almost out. That's why I bought it because I've been squeezing whatever I can. Literally because the pump is too... Um, mm, it's too... <laughs> there's not enough in here for me to like squeeze it out. And like it's dirty because, you know, as I say, people are animals and they just... They try, they open it, they try it. They don't even like bother to close it they just leave it there open you know how many bottles were open i was like wow bro people really be crazy out here miami like they don't care about anyone and this lotion 7.99 7.99 i don't know why it's never sold out <laughs> it's the best thing ever so yeah that's it that was my haul i feel like i was talking forever but i was also shopping forever because people were just everywhere like it's saturday and i know it's probably the only time people have to shop so i don't really blame them i also had to shop today because i don't have any other time but it is hot it is so hot i just wanted to get home honestly i spent a lot of money <laughs> just doing three stops in the same plaza and just buying things that i needed to re-up on so but if you enjoyed this please give me a thumbs up Please subscribe to my channel. We're almost 500 subscribers and I'm so excited. I'm going to try to do the biggest giveaway ever. Like ever. So stay tuned for that because I'm trying to accumulate products together to give away. And I'm just really excited. And I'm so happy to be hitting 500. So thank you so much because it literally wouldn't be without you. That's it for me. <laughs> and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. now i had to buy literally everything you know like body care teeth care skincare wise like you know body care like lotion stuff i need to go spend money on everything now so <laughs> that's what i'm doing so you know, prices over here the arctic fox be Today was the day they chose to, to cut the, the tree trunk. Today was the day. Of course it was. It was quiet for three hours before I started filming. And now that I clicked record, it ha three minutes hasn't even passed. They're cutting wood. That's fucking fantastic. Alright. Massage a few drops onto... And the ordinary... <laughs> Bro, do you really must, must you really do this right now? I cry. <laughs> the noise now <laughs> all right so and any of i wanted them she did want anyone else would she did what anyone else that i weared 
a little of this on. Why do I have fluff all over me? So I'm going to keep trying it. I can't do this anymore. I need to hurry up and finish. <laughs> By bringing... I'm trying to... Should I put my hair down? I don't know. I don't... I'm not feeling that right now. <laughs> oh, my battery's about to die. Something tells me that it just wasn't charging. <laughs> 